everybody. This is Ernie Hatmaker, and I'm out in the Three Sisters bed today. I moved one of the Alibaba melons out here, um, and that was two days ago. And it's already hit the ground. It's got a flower. It loves it out here in the Three Sisters bed. Um, I'm probably not going to be saving any of the seeds. And I say that because if I save any of the seeds, they're probably going to get mixed with squash and all that. But uh, we're going to enjoy that melon. I've been cutting, um, trimming the bottom leaves off these um, gray squash and golden zucchini because I really need to uh, keep the snails from, you know, eating the lower leaves, keep the squash bugs from hiding underneath all these leaves so I've even like tried to pull up some of the lower leaves from the corn um, I have found two squash eggs here or there on the fruit not on the leaves which is kind of strange and um, I haven't seen any squash bugs just saw something weird on top of a leaf and I don't know what it oh Okay, I think it's just uh, grass from where Ed was doing some weed eating. Check this out guys, first day off from work this week. I ain't off from work, I'm working. <laughs> I saw the sun illuminate something and it looks like a clutch of eggs, but it's not. It's like, how did I miss that? So we haven't really um, been dealing with uh, squash bugs like normal could be because these guys are eating eggs before we find them or um, I've seen a couple of juvenile stink bugs here or there I saw one squash bug I didn't know they flew um, one adult um, it was on uh, the roof of the shed but it wasn't out here the dragonflies are, are out because everywhere I walk the little baby grasshoppers are jumping up and flying and the, the uh, dragonflies are catching them. Just... So anyway, that's what I've been doing today. Uh, look at that. The grass will find a way. These weeds are determined to be here. They're coming out from under the paper.